Hi there, chickadee. How you doing today? Thanks so much for joining us today. We are Two Real Chicks. I'm Carla. I'm Cindy. And we welcome you to our channel. If you're new, hello. We're so happy to see you. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe. What she said before you leave. Today is the second installment of the Battle of the Drugstore Cleansers. We have been testing loads and loads and loads of different cleansers from the drugstore. Now, let's be specific. We are only testing cleansers specifically for dry or maturing skin or normal skin. We are not doing any foaming cleansers and we are doing only gel and cream cleansers. We don't want to, you know, egg on the maturing part by drying our skin out even further. Exactly. Especially as we age, we lose some of that elasticity and we lose some of those natural oils. So we're going specifically for cleansers that appeal to most of you and that are most suitable for those of us over 40 or if we're honest over 50 and over 60. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah. 60 is the new 40. So that makes 50. The new 30. 30. Hot, Hot diggity. diggity. Oh, excuse me. Hot diggity. My skin is normal to dry. I'm very dry. I have very dry skin. Could be from being in the sun so much. Yeah, you can tell I'm in the sun a lot too. <laughs> so let's get started right now. I am going to start this round of the Battle of Drugstore Cleansers with something that's become a cult classic and quite iconic. Yes, it is. This is the CeraVe Hydrating Cleanser for normal to dry skin. Now CeraVe makes several different versions of their cleanser. This one I specifically chose the hydrating version for normal to dry skin because that's what I have. What can you say about CeraVe that hasn't already been said? Nothing. This is indeed a fabulous cleanser. If you've never tried it, it comes out very nice and creamy, almost gel-like. Yes, but very creamy. Very creamy, very soothing, very, very cleansing. No <laughs> smell at all. I usually do a double cleanse with it. I like to wash my face twice with it, but it is a beautiful cleanser. It gets your makeup off, it gets your eye makeup off, it leaves your face very clean, and it does indeed leave your face feeling hydrated without it feeling greasy or oily. It feels as if it balances my skin out so that maybe if there's a little oily patch on my nose, it kind of balances that out. But if there's a dry patch on, say, my cheek, it balances that out. My skin feels very, very smooth, soft, and nourished when I use this particular cleanser. What else is there to say? There's nothing. It's a it's cult classic. It's a classic. It also has ceramides and hyaluronic acid in it. And this one varies in price depending on where you get it. Anywhere from $7.99 to $14.99 is what I've seen it for. Yeah. Yeah. I like the $14.99. No, the $7.99. I like the $7.99. I was getting ready to say, you want to pay more money? Oh, goodness. What have you got? You've heard me talk about the Simple, Simple brand before, and you've heard me talk about the Micellar Water before. I still love it. I use it to cleanse my face with. I just go through these little cotton pads, soak it up, wipe it down, and it just does what it's supposed to do. It cleanses my face and moisturizes, believe it or not. It's, it's water, but it's got something in it. Shall I put on my glasses and read? Why don't you? It is indeed called a cleansing water, and many micellar waters are cleansers. It, oh, look, it does say it hydrates. See? See? I thought it felt like it hydrates. It's doing what it's supposed to do. It's excellent stuff. I do love it. As you can see, I, uh, this is my second bottle, but I'm already into this. But, you know, just, hmm, we're going to play. Just saturate my little cotton ball and start rubbing. Oh, let me do you. Do me, do me. Do you. I don't smell anything. No, me neither. Me neither. But I do love it. It's inexpensive. It's simple. Squirt and wipe, squirt and wipe. I might go through two pads. 
Does it get your makeup off? It does get my makeup off. I go through three pads with the makeup one. I like it. I like it. I like putting simple stuff on my face. So, Carla, what do you have for us in this battle? I have never tried a Vino product. So in this battle of the drugstore cleansers, I've been trying several. And these are the Avino Active Naturals Positively Radiant Daily Cleansing Pads. I like Avino. I do like Avino. Gently exfoliates to reveal skin's natural radiance with moisture-rich soy extract. And I would say that is absolutely true. I really like these. They come in a pre-moistened pad that's quite large. Oh, that is nice size. It's already saturated with the liquid to clean your face. And on one side, it's smooth. Feel that? Oh, yeah. Feels like felt. Then on the other side, ooh, does not feel like felt. It has a little bit of grit to it on the other side, so you can flip it over and get a little bit of exfoliation anywhere that you want it. So you have the smooth side for like around your eyes, which by the way, it does remove eye makeup beautifully. I have very sensitive eyes, doesn't bother my eyes at all. And then on the other side, I'll go in if I have any rough patches or any dry skin or any flaking or anything like that, and just kind of buff it out. You have to make it's that noise. Like jingle bells. Jingle all the way. You're required to make that noise when you do it. These work really well, non-irritating. They leave my face feeling balanced, clean. They can be borderline drying. Really? And I say borderline because it doesn't leave my skin feeling dry, but it doesn't leave it feeling overly hydrated. Oh. I would just say it leaves it feeling clean. But if you're going to cleanse your face and then immediately put your products on afterwards, I don't see an issue there. If you have extremely dry skin, try it, see how it works. It may work beautifully for you. I can see this working for a lot of different skin types because mm -hmm. I don't see anything in it that's going to foul you up. I really like these a lot. I like them a lot more than I expected that I would. So these are the Aveeno Positively Radiant Daily Cleansing Pads. Really like these. These were somewhere between $5.99 and $8.99, somewhere in that price range. You get 28 you may need to use more than one pad if you have a lot mm -hmm. of makeup on. So you're basically getting one a day for a month. If you use one in the morning, that's one. If you use one to two at night, then you've got three a day. So you may need to go through three containers of this a month if you're going to use this as your primary cleanser. But it's a great makeup remover. It's also great in the morning for a real quick morning cleanse. I do like them. Impressed with these. I will purchase these again. Perfect. What's your next one? Mine is unusual. Mine is not something you would think to get, but I use it every day right now. Now I've heard good things about that type of cleanse though. This is just pure vitamin E oil. Just pure vitamin E oil. It's age-defying antioxidants. I used to use coconut oil to, to cleanse my face with, and then I heard a few stories from different esthetician, esthe, esthe, skin experts, skin experts who said that coconut oil, yes, it's a great moisturizer, but what it also does is dull your skin if you use it on your face. Shut the front door! I was like, no! Coconut oil is great on your arms and your legs or your whatever, feet. your feet, but I, I have stopped using it on my face because of that. Ah, huh, so this is, this is vitamin E oil and I use it just like I would the micellar water. You know, squirt it on a little pad, scrub it in and my face feels really moisturized, duh, yeah. because it's oil and I'm just very happy with it. I'm very happy with it. It gets the makeup off, it just melts it off. Vitamin E oil is known for so many wonderful properties from cleansing to healing. It's amazing. So, I mean, if it'll clean, heal, some people even think that it helps with scarring. Uh, it, it may. I don't know. It's good stuff. It is good stuff. I'm so glad you brought that one. Yes, I, I love it. It's what I've been using lately. 
Um, I may use this like maybe in the morning, but I definitely use this at night. Now, what yeah. brand is that? This is called Vital Care. I'm sure I got it off Amazon. I'm sure I did. But you can probably find it anywhere. It's vitamin E oil. I mean, anywhere. At a drugstore price. At a drugstore price. Any somewhere near you. All right, so we have these four in round two of the Battle of the Drugstore Cleansers. Now, if you missed round one, we will link it up above and down below so you can check out our previous winners and our previous contenders who made it to the semifinals of that round and who's going to make it to the semifinals in this round. I have an idea of which one mine's going to be. I'm having a tough decision. You're going with ding, 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 ding. Vitamin E oil because it's good for you. How, how can you go wrong with that? You cannot. This one is going to come as a surprise to many of you. I had a hard time deciding. Really? I truly did because I really do like these. But because the CeraVe is just so beautiful, creamy, soothing, cleansing, has the good ingredients in it as well. I am going to go with it for obvious reasons, but I think these are very good cleansing pads and I would definitely buy them again. So I am going to make the winner of this round, Sarah B for me, vitamin E oil for me. And that is round two of Battle of the Drugstore Cleansers. Now, if there's a particular drugstore cleanser you would like to see us try out, let us know in the comments section below. And while you're headed down that way, we would love for you, if you're not already subscribed, to hit that subscribe button. And next to that subscribe button, you'll find a bell. Bing! And if you ring that bell, it will notify you each time we upload a video. We're adorable. You don't want to miss us. No, and we do Battle of the Drugstore Cleansers every other month. And you are going to want to find out which ones we recommend. And if you have recommendations for us, be sure to tell us. That wraps up round two of the Battle of the Drugstore Cleansers from Two Real Chicks. Be sure to check out round one. We appreciate you joining us so much. It makes our day that much more special when you keep us company. We're Two Real Chicks. I'm Carla. I'm Cindy. And until next time, mwah, we love you. Bye.